how is surveillance technology disproportionately impacting black people, people of color, immigrants, the poor, uh, the unhoused, and any other marginalized communities? Surveillance has always disproportionately affected the most marginalized among us. Um, we know through historical examples like um, the Black Power Movement in the 60s, queer liberation, um, environmental activists in the 80s, um, Muslim communities um, after September 11th, and uh, Latinx communities um, surveilled by uh, Customs and Border Patrol and um, Immigration and Customs Enforcement. So there's a long history of surveillance targeting um, people who are already um, all, uh, already marginalized in our society and by our government. And so it's really important to think about whenever um, new surveillance technology becomes available to the governments and government agencies to make sure that they don't continue harming those communities.